and welcome back to another video for your soul evolution. I just wanted to throw something out there real quick. As you know, I've made a couple of videos about this book, Awaken the Immortal Within by Jason Brashears. And as I become more and more aware of things, I want to share with you the things that I'm becoming so aware of. And one of those things is my beliefs. And as I'm coming into contact with other people and learning what their beliefs are, I just wanted to throw this out there. If you have a hardcore belief, then you need to stick to that belief. If you are not going to put in the time and effort to change that belief, which you absolutely can do through affirmation and things like that. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. Most of you know I am a carnivore. I only eat meat and eggs and dairy and animal products. We live on a cattle ranch. We have our own beef. It's all grass fed, no antibiotics, no hormones, all of that stuff. And I get people saying that red meat beef will give you cancer, okay? If you believe that to your core, then you absolutely need to stay away from red meat because you're gonna get cancer because that is your hardcore belief that you have, okay? If you believe that staying out in the sun all day is gonna give you cancer, if you are scared of the sun and you feel like if you don't layer on two inches of sunscreen to avoid the sun and getting cancer, then you absolutely need to layer on that sunscreen every day, every time you're out in the sun. It's those beliefs that are shaping your reality. My 10 year old, he, he believes in the boogeyman, okay? And he believes that Every night when he goes to bed, he puts his bean bag up against his closet door and he believes that that will keep the boogeyman from coming out of his closet and into his bedroom. And I tell him, if that's what you believe, if you believe in the boogeyman and you believe that he's going to stay out of your bedroom, if you shove that big heavy bean bag up against your closet door, then that's what you need to do to help your sweet little self get you some nice peaceful rest at night because he's 10 years old and he is not going to dedicate the time and effort to clear that belief. We're going to, we'll work on that later. But do you see what I'm saying? If there are things that we all believe to our very core and either we have to change those beliefs or we got to stick to them because those are the things that are shaping your reality. They're not all negative. I'm just naming a few because there are some that we need to try and work through. We need to take the time to do affirmations to get rid of those beliefs so that they do not continue to shape our reality and bring us negative effects. I have so many animals right underneath me right now. I have three dogs. I have my cat. I'm surrounded by chickens. And I absolutely believe that all of these animals are just sending love and affection into my energy and into my heart space. And so that's what I'm gonna believe and that's what I'm gonna get. I love each one of these animals and they love me back. I don't love this fly that's attacking my face. So anyway, just some food for thought. Let me know what you think and I'll see you on the next video.